Welcome back to the channel, ScooterATVSales.com at Scooter City Reno, bringing you how to start my Apollo ATV. Now, this video applies to the Apollo ATVs. No matter what model it is, it could be the Blazer 9, which I have in front of me, or the Falcon X, or any other Apollo brand model ATV. Now, these fundamentals will apply to all other brands as well, but this is exclusively for the Apollo Blazer 9 and the Falcon X. So I recently received numerous calls from customers out of the area, of course, because over here we give you an orientation at Scooter City Reno on how to work all your features, how to start your ATV, and generally when people take them home, our customers take them home, they do know how to start their ATV. So this is for your out-of-state customers, and even locally if you forgot how to turn it on. All right, so you're gonna walk up to your ATV this is your keys. The manufacturer provides two keys and this is the parental remote right over here. You walk over to your ATV, you haven't ridden it for a while. You put the key into the switch. Now this is called a switch right here. You turn it on. Now for the kids ATVs, Apollo Blazer 9 or the Falcon X, you guys. You either step on the foot brake to activate the starter or you pull in the handbrake or you can lock it in as well for your cold starting so it stays in place so you either pull the brake lever on the right side as shown here or you step on your foot brake here now this activates the starter there's a starter switch in in this uh, assembly right here so keep that in mind there's a wire that comes down here so this activates the starting system as well as there's one here on the foot brake right under here so you walk in you put your key switch in you've turned it on you have it in neutral you place it in neutral with the lever over here to the left side make sure that your lanyard right here is plugged in so that always has to be plugged in you guys this is your on and off switch now generally on some of the chinese atvs you'll have your starter button over here or on this side sometimes but it's mostly on this side here because this is where your thumb throttle is. So you'll find over here, Apollo has placed a horn. So they put the starter button right over here where my finger is at, you guys. So this is the left side of the handlebar. So key switches in, ATV in neutral, lanyard plug, safety plug is plugged in. This is the on and off switch. Make sure your on and off switch is on, on as you can see. The on position right here where my finger is at. This is the starter button. So you gotta step, either pull this in, lock it in, or step on the foot brake. Right now I'm gonna step on the foot brake. Now for cold starts, you're gonna use the manual choke over there. And you keep it on the on position until it reaches a steady idle. Then you slowly bring it back and you turn it off. Wait about a minute or so, let that engine warm up, and then you're ready to ride. All right, so we warmed it up already today. So now we're gonna press the starter button. All right, so that's how you're gonna start your Blazer 9. The fundamentals are the same on the other brands as well, except you'll have your starter button below here. So just remember the procedures, the sequence that you have to follow here before you start your ATV. And you have to do that every time. So you have to be a bit mindful and make sure that your kids understand that they have to be mindful as well. You get to kill the motor. You can pull the lanyard plug. That'll kill the motor right there. That'll stop that engine to restart it again. Press on the foot brake. Press the starter button and you're on. Then you can also use the remote to shut off the motor here as shown. Press that blue button. You have to press the other key right below it there, that other function that resets the motor. You step on your foot brake or you pull your handbrake in. Press the starter button. Again, the switch here will shut it off as well. So again, turn this back on. Keep your foot on the foot brake. It allows you to start it. Same thing with this, on and off switch. You can turn it off right there. Make sure it's back on. You keep your foot on the foot brake. And you give it a go. Again, you guys, so this is for the Blazer 9, specifically, same as the Falcon X or any other Apollo brand ATV. 
but the fundamentals are the same on all the rest of the Chinese brands. Hope you guys find this well. If you like these type of videos, like, comment, and subscribe. And you'll find me posting on Instagram at Scooter ATV Sales. And hope all is well, and we'll see you guys soon. Take care.